Hey guys, it's Going to Games here. Welcome back to my channel. And today I wanted to share with you guys something that I think will help a ton of you out. Now, if you've ever done YouTubing or like streaming and stuff like that and recording, you'll know that a huge problem is not being able to hear a console like the Xbox and your PC at the same time. So today I'm going to talk to you guys about how you can you can hear both PC and console at the same time with the same headset. Now the only requirements about the headset are that it has to be 3.5 millimeter. There's no like certain specifications, there's no certain headset you have to have, it can be any headset. Personally I'm using Astro A40s, but it can work with like probably any of your headsets as long as they have this uh, the standard like 3.5 millimeter. And then the only thing you'll actually need to do this is um, a monitor to play on slash a TV, whatever you play on works, and a 3.5 millimeter male to male cable. And the links for the 3.5 millimeter male to male will be in the description on Amazon. They're super cheap, like five bucks you can buy one. Although when you're buying one, I recommend going for a little bit more expensive, probably like around 10 to 15 bucks, just to make sure it's really good. Because if you have like a cheap 3.5 millimeter cable, you could get a little bit of feedback. Nothing crazy, but it just makes it sound a little better if you have like a really nice 3.5 millimeter cable. So without further ado, I'm going to jump right into uh, how to do this. So first things first is to plug one end of the 3.5 millimeter cable into the back of your monitor. Also make sure you plug it into the headphone jack, whichever that may be, just plug it in there. Now next you're going to want to go to the back of your computer and find the microphone in jack and just plug the other end of the 3.5 into there. This also might work on the front mic jack, but I'm not really sure. And now just plug the 3.5 millimeter jack on your headset into the headset output on your computer. All right, so the next part is also super easy. You're just going to want to open the uh, the sound manager. And to do this, all you have to do is go down here and just type in audio and just click the first thing that comes up, manage audio devices. Now go over to recording and then go down to microphone. There might be a couple microphones and just read what it says right under there. This one obviously says my webcam mic, which I don't want. This one says my blue snowball, which I don't want. Find the one that says like the sound card that's in your computer. Mine is Realtek High Definition Audio, but this should be fairly easy to pick out no matter what your system is. Now what you're going to want to do is right click on that, go to properties, and then go to listen. I already have this set, but if I uncheck this I wouldn't be able to hear my game. And then just check listen to this device, hit apply and OK, and there you go. You can actually hear your Xbox One now. Full credit actually goes to a dude named Hazard Crew Gaming Incorporated, I think was the name. I don't know, but his link will be right in the description. He's the guy who actually came up with this method, and that's how I figured out how to do it. So yeah, absolutely huge thanks to him. He saved me a ton of time and money. So yeah, I just wanted to spread the word about this because I was looking for an audio mixer for absolutely forever. I even went to Best Buy and I was like, yo, do you guys have anything that could like help me do this? And they were like, nah, you're going to have to buy an audio mixer, so... Don't go to Best Buy and think you're going to get a cable that can do this. Because it's much better just to do this method. It's quicker, it's easier. Anyway, thank you guys for watching the video. I will see you in the next one. Hope you, I hope I helped you a little bit. Hope I helped some people. I was actually like mind blown when I found out that you could do this. Because I've been trying to, uh, I've been trying to figure out a way to do this for a really long time. So far, this is the only way that works without spending a single dime. Honestly, the only money you're going to have to spend on this is buying a 3.5 mm millimeter cable. And chances are you already have one of those because they're super common. But yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.